Hey guys, this is Jeremy at RC Collaborative, and today we're going to review the Red Cat Shockwave 4x4 Nitro Buggy. Yeah, record. <laughs> You could have, oh. Hey Zoe. Hey baby. Now don't drive over the concrete. I had the opportunity to play around with this little Red Cat um, Shockwave. This is a ready to run 10th scale four wheel drive buggy. Uh, it's nitro, it comes ready to run, comes with your two servos, your nitro motor, tires and axles and everything, you know, just ready to go. Um, got your body here. I've got my nieces and nephews over and uh, my neighbor had his dad bought this for his son. Um, not really knowing anything about nitro cars, you know, they got this as a gift and you know, it is a good gift. However, nitro cars may not necessarily be the first place to start. Um, but if you were going to start on nitro cars, this may be a good place to play with. Um, I just checked Red Cat's website. They sell this kit for $1.99 and then you buy the nitro starter kit for $30, which comes with 
these wrenches, the glow igniter, uh, screwdrivers, and it comes with this uh, fuel bottle. And then, you know, they got the 20% nitro from their website as well, it looks like. Now, there's not much left. I've run a bit of fuel through this. I've got it kind of tuned up and broke in. Now, my neighbor couldn't get it running. Um, he actually, this comes with a pull starter. He actually broke the pull starter trying to get it going. Um, so, I wasn't able to fix the pull starter. You know, those things are a pain to fix. So what I did is I have the one-way bearing and I have, um, this is a 12 millimeter socket and you put a taper side in towards the motor and turn it, uh, the drill clockwise, which actually turns the motor counterclockwise. And I start it with this. So um, I just pop off this turnbuckle. There we go. Pull this axle off. And then I start it uh, like so. Um, so far, you know, it is a tenth scale. So I'm used to A scale stuff, so everything does look chintzy to me and small. But it's a tent scale, it's not as big. So compared to my other cars, you know, um, it looks small. But compared to my B64, my associated, it looks pretty spot on with that. Um, I haven't found any durability issues with it. I would definitely say if you were thinking about getting one of these, um, it doesn't come with any extra glow plugs. So definitely buy a couple of those. Um, I haven't found the exact one yet. I'll find it and put a link in the description. It takes 20% nitro fuel. Um, the air filters had no oil. They came just plain Jane, um, oil, uh, dry sponges. So um, I don't actually have any air filter oil, so I just use my k &N air filter oil, which is, you know, do the same exact thing. It's fine. As long as it's got something in there. Um, yeah, so... You know, I don't normally do these kinds of videos because I don't usually have these kinds of things come along. But my neighbor had issues getting it going, so I have gotten it going. Um, I started with the drill, got it tuned up, it runs, got the nieces and nephews over. So I'm going to fire this up, let them drive it around, and we'll get some footage of the thing cruising around. Um, we have been driving it on the street, however, I think we might go to like a off-road kind of spot because... I think this is an off-road vehicle. I don't know much about it yet, um, and I don't want to tear it up on the street. So it's got uh, out drives there and dog bones. It's you know it's, it's got everything you'd want on it. It's got the shocks. They're oil filled. Um, you got your receiver box there. So yeah, let's start it up and, and get this thing get it rolling here.
Thank you so much for watching my videos and supporting me. Um, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and most importantly, comment below. Uh, please let me know if the videos helped you, what you would like to see in the next videos, and if there's anything we can do to make the quality of the videos better for you, that would be great. Um, if you're a vendor and you'd like to send me something to review, uh, product review, or would like to sponsor me for racing, uh, my email is just down here. Send me an email, we'll work it out. Um, other than that, collab on, guys.